Hello, today we're at uh, Beckton, Thames Waters main site for the London region uh, on a site visit for the Environment Committee and one of the things I've been keen to look at has been the lead tunnel operations. That's one part of the Thames tidal tunnel development under the Thames to deal with the 39 million tonnes of sewage that goes into the Thames. They've already started operations here and it's quite interesting to see how they're going about it and actually some of the synergies even with Crossrail, let alone the other operations of tunnelling under the Thames. Uh, it's certainly a very, very key to the infrastructure of London that this gets done well and in budget and to everyone's expectations. We also today looked at the new desalination plant. Simple fact is in London uh, we've got a growing population and we're actually using more water. And there's a real crisis uh, when it doesn't rain enough as to where we get our fresh water from. So Thames Water has spent a lot of money building a desalination plant which basically takes uh, water straight out of the Thames, filters to get all the muck out of it and then purifies it so that we can drink it. It's expensive, it's not a long-term solution, uh, but it is one way of dealing with the drought conditions we now face.